God bless you. Tonight we want to talk about taking your family issue to your husband is wrong. You are in a marriage. Don't take your sister issue, your brother issue, your mother issue. Don't judge it to your husband. Amen. Thank you. Hmm? Please, the Nigeria people, if you know you stays in worry, you stays in Sapple, you stays in worry, you stays in Sapple, you stays in Agbaro, you stays in Bini. Bini, is there movement in Bini? Please, the Nigeria people should write me on WhatsApp. I want to have, I want to meet you all. I want to have meeting with you. You stays in worry, you stays in Sapple, you stays in Bini. Write me out. I want to have a meeting with you people. Please, I want to meet you all. Okay, God bless you. God bless you. Now, the reason why I say don't take your issue to your, your family issue to your husband is very wrong. Because if you shake him out now, you 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 they judge your your husband, your family. they make it make your husband to see your family as if they are rag. They don't have respect for your family anymore. Before you could talk one, your husband, whenever you have problem together, that thing will surely come out because you have already used your own mouth to destroy your family to your husband. I'm not saying that you should hide anything from your husband. No, that is not what I'm saying. No, don't get it wrong. What I'm saying is this. There are some things that will happen between you and your sister, between you and your brother. Don't tell your husbands. Don't tell your husbands. Because when you tell them, they take advantage of it when they are angry with you. They will start insulting your family. Respect your husband family. Let your husband respect your family. Let them be engaged there. Don't put, don't bring down your sister or your brother to your husbands. It make them not to respect your sister. They will not respect. They will not respect your sister husbands. Even you in that marriage, you, you don't have respect because you don't see you finish. Let me check time. I'm closing by 10. You don't see you finish. Okay, you go, you go, the, the, your sister call, you say, he with your husband, get problem with this, that, oh, you call sit your husband, that, you call Josh for her. If you, your sister, your, your sister husband, they call your sister, say, your sister, they, they, they fled for her side, you call sit your husband, that, you call Josh for her. As you, they come out, as they, they break. As soon as get quarry, the man will use and cause you say, your sister, they, be not prostitute, you safe, not prostitute. Go say you and your sister na bed of the same feather. You know why if he get at take talk like that? It's because you are telling your husband, you are telling your sister and your and your brother's issue, your mother issue to your husbands. Is your husband? Is your king? Is your all and all? But it's not everything you tell him. It's not everything you tell him. It's not everything you tell him. Concerning your family. Learn how to protect your family. His own. Learn how to protect his family. Your husband's family is your family. Learn how to protect your husband's family also. Your husband's sister, if he trusts you, 
If you say get problem with your husband and he trust you, they will come call you, he come judge for you. Now big work be that, it's not easy. Your own man not to, not to, not to think how you take settle the matter. I'm telling you, now to think how you take settle the brother and sister together so that you'll be the best wife. Because maybe they don't want to talk to her. Make her talk to your wife. Me, wife, talk to her. I think that one is another honor that your husband's sister give to you. When your husband's sister call you and talk to you to talk to your husband, don't take advantage of your husband's sister. Don't go and insult her later with what he tell you. Settle them. Settle them. Make sure you bring peace between your husband and his sister. Don't support your husband to fight his sister, his mother, and his brother. And husband, don't support your wife to fight, fight a family. It's totally wrong. I don't want to know if you believe it or not. But I'm telling you nothing but the truth. I know you are expecting prophecy, prophecy, prophecy. Today I'm not prophesying. Today is even the prayer warriors day. I just st steal their day because of what I have for you people. I'm telling you the truth oh, because I love you. That is why I'm telling you the truth. Eh? I'm telling you the truth because I love you. If we can behave like this, our husband's side will be safe. Our own side will be safe. Because many problems that happen in marriage today is because you, you discuss your family issue with your husband too much. Or your husband. If your husband discusses his family issue to, with you, that they are quarreling, they are not agreeing, do everything you could do to settle them. If you cannot do it physically, back him up with prayer. Mm -hmm. Back him up with prayer. You see that it's going to help. Is going to help. Let's try and respect the both sides' self reputation. You keep your secret for your sister, but your sister is telling you a secret. Who are you to your sister? A secret that she is telling you, you are taking it to your brother, to your husband. Who are you to your sister? Are you your sister enemy? Are you your sister's enemy? Mommy, it's time for you to sleep for oh, please me. Time is over. My time is over because I have not slept for some days. This name. So if you love the topic that I bring out now, we will come out with a part three of this topic. 
if you love it please call and put in your contribution now call and put in your contribution now those that is watching me on youtube please try and subscribe to my youtube channel for you to get more of our video god bless you and when you subscribe put the button of notification comment and also click follow and for those of you that is watching me